soap opera. It was a lovely spring day, the kind of day that makes ducks want to sing. Oh, it's spring, and ducks are thinking about spring and duck-related things. La -da -da -da. Chirp was enjoying a different kind of music. What a beautiful song. Did you hear that, Quack? I did. Wrote it, sang it, heard it. Glad you liked it. Not your song. The Robin song. It was like spring. The meaning of spring. That? Cheer up, cheer up, cheer up, cheer up, cheer up. That's not a song. This is a song. Ducks are good. Ducks are best. Ducks are duty to than all the rest. Ah, yeah. Mm -hmm. A song has words. Robins can't do that. Yes, we can. Oh, I'm a red robin and I'm singing this song, so I just proved that you are wrong. Ah, but look, like, you can't sing. You're, you're not a duck. See, here we go. This is a song. It's made by a duck. If you're not a duck, then your song is all wrong. Quack. I can sing just as well as you. No, you can't. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Hi, guys. What? Why are you singing? Because I'm trying to show the ducks sing the best. And everyone knows that except certain red birds who won't listen to ducks. I, I, quack. I can go longer, you know. Ah, I did. Peep, don't you think that I sing the best? Come on, be honest. Aren't you impressed? You both sound good. Sort of. But look what I found. Peep showed them a bar of soap, something these birds had never seen before. What is this thing, Peep? This Whoa. thing that you found? This Whoa. thing lying on the ground? Ah. Oh. I don't know, but it smells nice. Kind of like rain. Mmm. It smells like flowers. A bunch of rainy flowers. Once more, you're wrong. You're out of luck. Because this thing here, it smells like duck! Mm. Or like food for a duck! Yeah! Oh. Yuck! Like I said, it smells like flowers! Ducks! Flowers! Ducks! Flowers! Hey! Why don't we just say that it smells like a duck in the rain holding flowers, okay? Okay! So, what should we do with it besides smell it? Hey! I think you'll all agree this thing should be with me in my pond! He makes me so mad. He's such a greedy, stuff-taking duck. Chirp, can you please stop singing? It's hurting my ears. I can't, because then Quack will say only ducks can sing, and it's just not true. Hmm. You see, Pete, this thing makes a very nice boat for me to sit on and float. <laughs> That's not funny. Hey, it's those things again. What things? Oh, yeah, right. Um, where was I? Those round, floaty things. I saw them once before. Remember I told you, but you didn't believe me. Hey, stop popping. Come on, I have to show peep. Drat. They were right there, the things. But I don't know where they went. Hmm. Well, anyway, it's nice and slippery now. <gasps> I have an idea! Whoa! <laughs> that is... Even 
even with the bubbles, soap is still fun. You can ride it or kick it, spin it and twist it. Oh, why am I singing about soap? I don't really know. Can I stop now? Thank you. <laughs> Ugh, I'm sticky and gooey. I think I'll wash off. Quack. Quack! You've got things all over you. It's those things. They've come back to me. Beautiful rainbow circles. How did you do that, Quack? Well, I just went into the water. You could do it, too, if you weren't such a scaredy bird. Uh, no thanks. Look, Chirp, they pop. <coughs> okay, stop. That's enough. You're tickling. <laughs> You're tickling the duck. Duck is tickling the duck. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> It's going to rain. Let's come back tomorrow and play some more. Good idea. Are you ever going to admit that robins can sing? No, no, -uh, don't think so. Well then, goodbye. Oh, why can't she just admit that singing is a duck's job? Maybe by tomorrow she'll forget all about it. Boy, I sure hope so. Yeah, mm. You know, a bird who won't stop singing is pretty hard to take. I know. Bye, Quack. Goodbye. <laughs> Quack. Quack was very happy to rest his voice overnight. But all too soon, it was morning. Wake up, duck, wake up! It's time to get up, duck, get up! Will you stop with this singing? You're making me crazy! I won't quit until you admit that Robin's are. Where did it go? That thing we were playing with. Oh, it's right here. I was sleeping on it. What? It's gone. Someone stole it. Then I was watching it all night. I didn't take my eyes off it for a second. I don't think. It's on your back, Quack. That can't be it. That thing's tiny. <sighs> That's it, all right. It smells exactly like a duck in the rain holding flowers. How did it get so small? You probably sang it to death. <laughs> you know, there's one very good thing about this. What? You finally, finally stopped singing! Oh, Stop it! Yeah! And that is what's called a taste of your own medicine. We are going to play with some soap on this table. I'm trying to see if the soap can slide. The soap doesn't really go that far. Here's the water. Put the soap in. Ah! Now it can slip. Yeah. yeah, now it goes really fast. Let's get the table nice and wet. Vamos a mojar la mesa toda. Uno, dos, tres. You can play hockey. Yeah. The more soap suds, it gets more slower. Because it's sticking to the table, isn't it, Isabella? The circle one goes more quicker. This one's littler, and it can go more faster. It doesn't stick to it. The round one spins a lot. The rectangle bar doesn't. Let's build our ramp. We are going to slide the soaps down the ramp. I'm trying to make the dry soap go down the ramp, but it's not slippery enough. What's happening? Nothing. Kellen is getting it nice and wet. Sorry. 
<laughs> Let's do a race. Una, dos, tres. The slope that's clear is more slippery than the non-clear one. <laughs> Ready? Try having fun with slippery soap. Yeah. 